Ezekiel Elliott is down to three teams right now. The Bengals, which is very interesting. The Jets, quite surprising. And then the Philadelphia Eagles. Like, huh? I, I haven't talked about Justin Evans because he's kind of like a nobody, and same with the uh, the linebacker we got. They're okay pickups, you know. I'm fine. I'm okay with it because they are spots where we just need people to fill in at the moment. But after getting Rashad Penny a little over a week ago. And Ezekiel Elliott talking about wanting to be number 15 again from college. And he's considering coming to Philly. And that's his, like, top top spot. And people are saying that, oh, oh, he's going to Philly. Now, I, 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 I don't want to bring back the DeMarco Murray talk because I think this is much different. Because DeMarco Murray was never healthy. Um, he was ne well, not never healthy, but he was always battling something between when he was with Dallas and then when he came here and also the scheme just didn't fit well with him but I know we got Rashad Penny but like if we want to incorporate if we want to have somebody who can really run downhill with our with our offensive line the big back that is I mean he's only what 27 28 years old Get him on a two-year, uh, cheap two-year deal. I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm not against it. I'm just surprised that this is what we're talking about right now. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. I mean, I was gonna post a video about potentially picking up Bobby Wagner because I know we picked up the one linebacker, but having a veteran presence who plays at a level like Bobby Wagner would be huge. But now we're talking more offensive stuff, more in the backfield. I mean, that, that makes me question a lot about, like, are we making changes to the scheme we run? Because Elliott wouldn't really run, run – well, and I can't even say that because he's got a good burst of speed when he gets up there. It's just he's a big run through the tackles, break, break a few tackles type of running back, similar to Rashad Penny, but Rashad Penny's much smaller. And Kenny Gainwell, we know Kenny Gainwell is extremely small compared to both Penny and Elliott. And then Boston Scott's even smaller than all of them. So, like, in my head, I'm I'm not against it. It's just a matter of how much we spend on him. And really, like, if he comes in shape, comes to Philly in shape. So, if that's how... I can't believe I'm talking about it. I can't, I can't believe I'm actually thinking about this. It was different with DeMarco Murray because he was such a high talent at the at that point. He was much younger. He was just he dealt with a few injuries and didn't fit our scheme with Chip Kelly. He went to Tennessee and had two good years, but then retired early because he just didn't have the the, the desire to play and uh, play football anymore. But Ezekiel Elliott, I mean, and he's picking three teams that are potential playoff teams. Like he's leaving the Cowboys. He got cut by Dallas, who's a playoff team. The Jets, if they get Aaron Rodgers, are gonna be up there with the Bills to, to win the division over in the AFC East. And then the Bengals, they have been division winners, championship caliber teams the past two seasons. Eagles are now Super Bowl uh, loser, championship caliber team uh, that can get right back up there, similar to the Bengals, similar to the Chiefs. And he's picking between the Eagles, Bengals, and Jets. I'm shocked. Let me know what you guys think. I'm, I'm like, I'm kind of conflicted, but at the same time, in my head, I could see it working out, kind of, kind of. But again, I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked. I'm, I'm very shocked.